Once upon a time, amidst a realm veiled in mist and moonlight, stood an ancient, decrepit tower shrouded in mist, its silhouette looming ominously against the moonlit sky. Against this ethereal backdrop, a lone figure emerged from the shadows. His name was Victor, a skilled illusionist, as he approached the tower with determination in his eyes. Tonight, I shall weave the greatest illusion of all. Victor ascended the winding staircase of the tower, his steps echoing in the hollow silence as he climbed higher and higher. The air grew thick with anticipation as he neared the top, where his grand illusion awaited. The stage is set. It's time to unleash my magic upon the world. Victor reached the pinnacle of the tower, where he began to prepare his elaborate illusion. He arranged mirrors and conjured mystical sigils, his hands moving with practiced precision as he set the stage for his performance. Every detail must be perfect. The audience will witness the spectacle of a lifetime. With a flourish of his hands, Victor activated his illusion, filling the tower with dazzling lights and mesmerizing displays. Spectral images began to dance through the air, twisting and shifting in a hypnotic symphony of color and sound. Let the illusion begin. May it captivate and enchant all who behold it. Victor's illusion captivated an unsuspecting audience, drawing them into its spell with promises of wonder and awe. Gasps of amazement filled the air as onlookers marveled at the seemingly impossible feats unfolding before their eyes. I've never seen anything like this before. It's truly magical. Suddenly, cracks began to appear in Victor's illusion, revealing glimpses of darkness and despair beneath the surface. The once enchanted audience recoiled in horror as the true nature of the illusion was unveiled. No, this can't be happening. Stay under the spell. As the illusion crumbled, Victor got consumed by madness, his mind fracturing under the weight of his deception. He struggled to maintain control as reality twisted and distorted around him, threatening to consume him whole. Embrace the madness. Let it set you free. A brave onlooker, sensing the danger, attempted to break the illusion's hold over the audience. With a resolute voice, they implored their fellow spectators to see through the deception and reclaim their sanity. Snap out of it. Don't let the illusion control you any longer. Through sheer force of will, the audience broke free from Victor's illusion, their minds clearing as they shook off its influence. Reality snapped back into focus, revealing the crumbling tower and the chaos wrought by Victor's deceit. It was all just smoke and mirrors. We almost lost ourselves to the illusion. As Victor's illusion collapsed around him, he was confronted by the consequences of his actions. He faced the wrath of the audience, their anger and betrayal directed squarely at him. You deceived us all. How could you toy with our minds like that? In a moment of clarity, Victor realized the error of his ways and begged for forgiveness from those he had wronged. I was blinded by my ambition, but I see now the harm I've caused. Please forgive me. He vowed to use his talents for good, promising to atone for his sins and mend the broken trust of the audience. As dawn broke on the horizon, Victor emerged from the ruins of his illusion, reborn with a newfound sense of purpose. With the support of the audience, he set out to redeem himself and prove that true magic lies not in deception, but in honesty and integrity. From this day forth I shall use my talents to bring joy and wonder to the world without resorting to illusions or deceit, 